proud to be an ant. In a big colony of ants, there was a small ant who always dreamt of being a ladybird or a beetle. One day, she was fed up of being a tiny, helpless ant. She thought that the rules for the ants were very strict. On one windy day, she grabbed and held on to a big leaf that came flying past. She sat on it and flew high in the air. When she was flying high in the sky, she saw no sign of any beetle or ladybird nests. But one thing which she could clearly see was a big ant hill. The ant hill was strong enough to withstand the windy weather. The ant hill was visible from a great distance too. The tiny ant realized the power of teamwork that an ant army had. She also realized that ant hills constructed by ants were very strong. So finally, she felt very proud to be an ant. The Special Cow Once upon a time, there was a special cow in a village. This cow produced coffee-flavored milk instead of plain milk. One day, a cafe owner from a big city visited the village. He came to know about this special cow and got very impressed. The cafe owner convinced the cow owner to sell his special cow to him. When he reached home with this special cow, his wife advised him to return the cow to the village. She felt that the cow, being a village cow, would not be able to survive in city conditions. But the man ignored his wife's advice. Within a few days, the cafe became very popular. But gradually, the taste of the coffee-flavored milk changed. It started tasting less sweet and less creamy. Soon, the cafe started losing its customers. The cafe owner realized his mistake and understood that the cow missed its village. Soon, one day, he finally took the special cow back to its village. The Magical Teeth Long, long ago, there was a lizard. He invented a magical set of teeth. He thought of fixing those teeth on one of his toads. After the magical teeth were fixed, the toad became a happy and smiling amphibian. He ate everything and started speaking too. Once, the lizard noticed that the toad was getting fond of eating candies. I am enjoying these candies a lot, said the toad merrily. Look after your teeth, Mr. Toad. Brush them and keep them clean so that they may stay cavity free. Too many sweets will spoil your teeth. The lizard kept instructing the toad. But the toad did not pay any attention. Gradually, the toad's teeth started decaying. He discovered, to his shock, that there were holes in his teeth. Then the poor toad's teeth started falling off. And soon, the toad lost all his teeth and also the ability to talk. Poor Mr. Toad! If he had kept his teeth clean, he would not have lost them. The Colourful Animal Planet Several years ago, there existed an animal planet. On this planet, each kind of animal lived in its own special land. The orange elephant lived on the orange land. The blue crocodiles lived on the blue land and so on. One day, on the land of the orange elephants, a baby elephant came running towards the other elephants. He seemed quite horrified. He said that he had seen some purple animals at the border of their land. None believed the baby elephant. So, he asked them to follow him to the border. When they reached the border, they saw a different colored land. It was purple land full of purple animals. The purple animals were equally amazed too. Upon meeting one another, the orange and the purple animals decided to search for other colored animals. When all the animals were finally at one place, heavy rain began pouring. The rain mixed up 
all the animals colors leaving each one with the color it has today thanks for watching do like share subscribe to sahil book house